This is the 2019 Chaparral 370FL. This has a nice return radius. It's almost 90 degrees. I think it's 88 degrees. Has a big pass-through storage. In case you want to put a TV out here, that's what this is for, the TV hookups, satellite, and your plug. You can also see it has the, the large power awning that does have LED lights in it. This has a bigger grab handle, the nicer steps. Now this also has the Asdell um, composite wall backers. And then it also has the all weather shield. And then your internet is boosted on here too with the wine guard. So it, uh, it'll pick up a signal and boost it. And then it's secure for your camper. You also have a spot, this is a mount for a TV. And of course you got your plugs for it or for other stuff outside. These are all your cable or satellite hookups. Outside speakers. Awning. Just make sure you see the steps again. And this does have the auto leveling. This has the bigger water heater. It'll reclaim almost 20 gallons an hour if you're using gas and electric. This one has a ladder on the back with the backup camera um, pre-wired and so it's all set up for it. You still have to buy the backup camera, but it is pre-wired for it. This is 50 amp service. Of course, you got your second door back here with a scare light above it, a yellow one. And then you have your slides. I wanted you to see this over here where we have a light, all your cable hookups, so this is where everything comes in. Your fresh water hookup, you have a black tank flush, outside shower, this is where you'd winterize. You also have a battery disconnect and there's the auto leveling controls. By the way, the auto leveling controls are right on the door, right next to it. Let's have the nicer slam latch doors. You have one propane tank on this side, it's a 30 pound. You have one on the other. Come in you have your converter box right here so this is where all your circuit breakers and automotive fuses will be also notice you don't have any carpet on, on the top of the steps and then they did a heat duct and a light when you come in you got three drawers right here with the nicer glides nice cabinet with hooks and then of course shelves and a drawer down at the bottom for bigger stuff. This has the table and four chairs with the extension piece and then also you have storage inside the chairs. Lights directly above, more hooks, the big residential fridge. And freezer. This one also has a ceiling fan and a fantastic fan. You have one air conditioner back here and you can see there's another one up front. This has the solid surface countertops with the nicer stove. By the way, the stove has a light where they all the knobs glow blue. This has a bigger um, microwave. And of course, the nicer sink faucet with sprayer that extends out, covers over it, and it's two-sided sink. Couple of outlets right there. You also have an outlet right there. And another one over on this little area. 
So we go up the steps into the main living area. Does not come with a TV. It does have the, the bounce though, so you can just buy the, deep, the TV. I believe this takes a 50 inch. Has a nicer fireplace. The couch. This has all the Thomas Paine furniture with the massagers, the heat, and the lighted cup holders. And then both of these, this couch and this one both turn into a bigger bed. By the way, when you come in, there's a light switch right when you come in the door. Your control panels with all your other lights and slide out controls. And then you have the electronic part here which has like owner's manuals and other reference things in there and other power controls. Notice that your your there's no registers in the floor. They're all in the side areas. That's what you saw on the step. Air conditioning controls are right here. This has the big shower with the nicer spray nozzle and the skylight above. And again, the foot flush toilet, more hooks. Now, since the ceiling's so high, they put a fan switch over here and for the vent to raise up and down. Three nice drawers and a big cabinet, medicine cabinet. Your bed. Cup holders to the side. This is a king in place of the queen. It has reading lights. Those do move. Both of those lights do. Cabinetry up above. Big window in the back. A lot of space right here. And then of course you got your hanging closets. Has cabinetry down below for you to use too. And then, of course, some drawers. Spot for a 32-inch TV. By the way, the TVs, you do got to watch some of that, but I think you're good with 32 and a 50-inch for the, the main area. But I know that there's a couple goofy ones. So I'll be happy to get you exact dimensions if you're wanting to get them before. Another vent for the heat in here. And this is where your washer and dryer can go, or it can be just another big closet. So it's all pre-set up for it. They make a combo unit, runs about $1,300. My name's Frank Henderson. Feel free to give me a call. 616-250-0440. Thanks for watching.